The African wild dog is an endangered species, also known as African hunting dogs. They resemble domestic dogs, but have four rather than five toes on each foot and huge ears. African wild dogs can run at about 35 miles per hour for distances up to 3 miles, which enables them to wear down their prey. Their greatest speed, sustainable for a very short time, is about 44 miles per hour. So, here comes in ninth place the jackrabbit, an unlikely competitor. The jackrabbit is not a true rabbit but an American member of the hare family. Unlike rabbits, hares do not make burrows but spend their lives above ground, even raising their young in the open. Relying on its powerful hind legs to escape from predators, the jackrabbits run in a series of leaping bounds and can reach speeds of 45 miles per hour. So here comes in 8th place, Greyhounds. Bred for racing and hair coursing, Greyhounds can sprint at 46 miles per hour. They are also agile, able to jinx to follow a prey animal's attempts to outmaneuver them. Their speed results from their large hearts, strong muscles and light bones. Although they have traditionally been hunting dogs, greyhounds are not naturally aggressive animals and make gentle and intelligent pets. In seventh place comes the lion, known as the king of the jungle. The lion is the second largest cat by weight after the tiger and the only large cat with obvious differences in appearance between males and females. They hunt mostly at night and most of the hunting is done by the females. Female lions can outrun males and they work together. Their top speed of 50 miles per hour can be sustained only for a few strides but they can maintain a burst of 35 miles per hour for longer. However, lions are inactive for most of the time and tend to sleep during the daylight hours. So coming in the sixth place, black buck. This antelope species is native to the Indian subcontinent and although once widespread is currently described as a near endangered species. The black buck antelope can reach and sustain a speed of 50 miles per hour. It has an exceptionally long stride and uses its speed to escape predators which include wolves and jackals. There are black bucks in the United States where the species was introduced in the last century. In fifth place comes wildebeests. Both species of wildebeests are new and African antelope rely on speed and endurance to escape predators. They can reach 50 miles per hour. They are particularly vulnerable during their annual migration, but the herd will attempt to protect young wildebeest by surrounding them with adult males. Fourth place, the springbok. This African antelope inhabits dry grassland in huge herds. Its name derives from its habit of jumping into the air from all four feet simultaneously. It is a fast runner but lacks endurance. It can run at a top speed of 50 miles per hour. Although it generally keeps this up for less than a mile. In third place comes the pronghorn. The pronghorn or American antelope is not in fact a member of the antelope family but the only surviving member of the American family of deer-like mammals. It can sustain a speed of 35 miles per hour for 4 miles a much greater endurance than most fast animals and can achieve a top speed of 55 miles per hour. In second place, the Mexican free-tailed bat. This bat is one of the most widespread animal species in North America, sometimes roosting in caves in huge numbers. Like most bats, they hunt insects using echolocation. Free-tailed bats are believed to be the fastest flying bat species because their tails enable them to take advantage of a flowing wind. Their maximum speed is in the region of 60 miles per hour. Believed to be the fastest animal in the world, the cheetah can sprint at 60 miles per hour 
and attain a maximum speed of over 70 miles per hour, but it rarely sustains top speed for more than a few seconds or runs for more than a minute. When it is sprinting, it spends more time in the air than touching the ground. Adaptations enabling it to run at a speed include enlarged nostrils, heart, and lungs. It runs by r running down its prey, which kills it by tripping and then suffocating the bite to the neck. Unlike most big cats, the cheetah can purr, do not roar. Please take a moment to like and subscribe. Thank you.